monotonic stack a powerful pattern that shows up in lead code problems where you need to find the next greater next smaller previous greater or previous smaller element in an array if you go on lead code there are currently 65 problems tagged with this approach which shows that it is an important topic to learn for coding interviews using this pattern you can reduce the time complexity of many array related problems from order of n square to order of n in this video i will share what a monotonic stack is a generic template for solving monotonic stack problems how to implement it in code plus i will walk you through multiple lead code problems to help you understand it better i will also share a resource where you can practice more problems using this pattern so let's get into it what is a monotonic stack a monotonic stack is a stack that keeps its elements in a specific order either always increasing or always decreasing in a monotonic increasing stack each new element you post is larger than the ones already in the stack using a monotonic increasing stack you can solve problems which involves finding the next smaller element or finding the previous smaller element in a monotonic decreasing stack each new element you post is smaller than the ones in the stack using a monotonic decreasing stack you can solve problems which involves finding the next greater element or finding the previous greater element a quick tip in most problems it's better to store the indices of the numbers in the stack rather than the actual values this gives you more flexibility when accessing values from the array by index here is a generic template for implementing the monotonic stack pattern in a slice an empty stack loop through elements in the array while the stack is not empty and the current element violates the monotonic property process and pop the top element from the stack at the end of the current iteration push the current element or its index onto the stack let's break it down with an example problem next greater element the task is to find the next greater element for each number in an array the next greater element is simply the first number to the right that's larger than the current number if no such number exists the result is minus 1 to solve this you could use a nested loop comparing each element to all of the elements to its right until you find a greater element but this approach has a time complexity of order of n square which gets slow for large arrays using a monotonic stack we can bring down the time complexity to order of n here we will use a monotonic decreasing stack to keep track of the indices for which we haven't found the next greater element the intuition behind this approach is when the current element is greater than the element at the top of a non empty stack we have found the next greater element for the top element so we pop the element from the stack and mark the current element as its next greater element next we push the current element onto the stack since its next greater element must be among the future elements let's walk through an example to make it more clear we maintain a stack to store the indices and the result array in a slice to all minus 1 values which is the default answer if no next greater element exists for an index now let's go through the array step by step at index 0 the stack is empty so we push index 0 at index 1 since 1 is smaller than 2 we push index 1 at index 2 5 is greater than 1 so we pop index 1 and update the result at 1 to 5 5 is also greater than 2 so we pop index 0 and update the result at index 0 to 5 then we push index 2 at index 3 6 is greater than 5 so we pop index 2 and set the result at index 2 to 6 and push index 3 at index 4 since 2 is less than 6 we push index 4 at index 5 3 is greater than 2 so we pop index 4 and set the result at 4 to 3 and push index 5 After processing all the numbers, our result array looks like this, which contains the next greater element for each number. Here is how it looks like in code. Here I am using Java, but you can find the code for other popular program languages in my GitHub repository called Awesome Lead Code Resources. Link is in the description. We use a stack to track the indices and maintain the elements in decreasing order of their values. We will also use a result list initially filled with minus one, which will store the next greater element for each index. As we iterate through the array. while the stack is not empty and current number is greater than the number at the index stored at the top of the stack we pop the top index and update the result for that index with the current number this works because the stack always holds indices of numbers for which we haven't yet found the next greater element once we find it we no longer need that index in the stack so we pop it update the result at that index and move on after popping all the smaller elements we push current index onto the stack for future iterations and finally return the result array which contains the next greater element at each index the time complexity of this approach is order of n since we traverse the array once and each index is pushed and popped from the stack at most once the space complexity is order of n due to the stack and result array in the worst case scenario we may end up storing all the indices in the stack such as when the input array is monotonically decreasing if you need to find the next smaller element instead of the next greater element simply change the condition in the while loop from greater than to less than next problem is lead code 739 daily temperatures You are given a list of daily temperatures and for each day you need to determine how many days you will have to wait for a warmer day. If there is no warmer day in the future, the result for that day should be zero. Let's go through an example to make this clear. 
Imagine you have the following temperatures over 8 days. On day 0, the temperature is 73 degrees. The next warmer day is day 1, when it's 74 degrees. So for day 0, we wait 1 day. On day 1, it's 74 degrees. The next warmer day is day 2, with 75 degrees. So again, we wait 1 day. On day 2, it's 75 degrees. But the next warmer day doesn't happen until day 6, when it's 76 degrees. So that's the 4 day wait, and so on. If we put all this together, the result looks like this. This problem is very similar to the next greater element problem. Instead of finding the next greater value, we need to find the difference in days between the current day and the next warmer day. Since we are looking for the next warmer day, we will use a monotonic decreasing stack to store indices. Here is what the algorithm looks like. Start with an empty stack, iterate through the temperature array. While the stack is not empty and the current temperature is warmer than the temperature at the index is stored at the top of the stack, pop from the stack, calculate how many days it took to find a warmer temperature and update the result for the popped index. Then, push the current days index onto the stack. In the end, return the result array after processing all days. The time and space complexities of this approach are both order of n, similar to the previous problem. Here are some more lead code problems you can practice using this approach. You can find these problems on algomaster.io. Simply head over to the practice page, search for this pattern, or use the filter dropdown and start practicing. On this platform, you can mark problems as complete or restart them for later revision. You can also find the links to GitHub and YouTube solutions for each problem. You can check out the full lead code patterns playlist here. I hope you found this video helpful. Make sure to subscribe so you won't miss my future videos. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.